your one word for 2023. What's going on, Scully Nation? Dr. Schilling bringing you today's daily insights. And you might be thinking, one word? That's all I get? Well, you can choose as many as you want, but I think it's important to have a theme for your year. And why would that be? Because it's going to bring you back home no matter where you are, no matter what situation you find yourself in, whether it's good, bad, or indifferent. When you focus on coming back to home base with that one word that's going to pull you through, drive you through, get you through, uh, inspire you, motivate you, keep you accountable, all this good stuff. When you focus on that one word, it can keep you back home. So stay tuned to the end and I'll share with you what mine is. Um, so I was trying to think about like how can I convey this concept, but I was looking through like um, word explosions. You might have seen these things where they have all these different words and stuff like that. So, um, I mean, there's things like growth, inspire, organize, feeling brave, um, thriving, growth, um, you know, positivity, elevate, all these different aspirational words that you can use to describe what you want to embody. Um, someone might just say consistency. They want consistency in their life. Um, so what could be a positive, uplifting, challenging word for you that maybe you found has been difficult for you in the past, but you can use to your advantage now because you can use it as sort of your, your mantra moving forward as 2023 progresses. We're only in you know, day th two, uh, so we have a lot of ample opportunity to flesh this out, and you can figure out maybe you want to change it as you go along. Maybe you want a handful of words. So, um, you know, do you want to be more mindful? Do you want to be uh, more present? Do you want to trust? Do you want more consistency? Like, what, like there's so many different words. I mean, good Lord, you could take your pick. Um, so my... Um, the primary word I'm focused on is unlimited, and that can go in a bunch of different directions, but unlimited honesty, unlimited truth, unlimited health, unlimited abundance, unlimited love, uh, unlimited generosity, unlimited gratitude. For me, the word unlimited means that there is nothing capping the possibilities that I can create based on my willingness to tap into what exists and not limit my thinking. So share with me what your favorite word is for this year, what you've put some thought into, what you're going to use as a, a, a reminder each day to focus you back into the task and say, what am I trying to accomplish this year? What am I trying to accomplish this hour, this minute, this day, this month, this quarter, whatever it is for you, however you keep yourself on track, however you say, this is how I'm working, this is what I want you to consider. And I'd love for you to share with your with us your word. Uh, just post in the comments below. Um, so be brave, be grateful, focus, growth, you know, all the fun stuff, all the great things. I'll see if I can add the, the word explosion that I found that I like the most, um, on here on a, on a post, but, um, you know, uh, I hope you will find your year to be unlimited. I hope you will choose to be unlimited, uh, find out where you feel limited and then decide who do I need to know? What do I need to learn? Um, what do I need to let go of in order to become unlimited myself? And uh, this can be your year. Uh, I fully expect it to be the best year of my life uh, because I just assume that every day is going to be better than my last and that my best days are ahead of me. So I hope you'll join me on that, that mission, on that feeling, and uh, feel inspired to create your life every day. No matter what happens to you, you are when you take 100% responsibility for what happens in your life, nothing can slow you down because you'll always find the positive from it and move on. So leave those as parting words, but have a great night. We'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, bye-bye.